Some people claim that they have a sweet tooth and it'll never go away. But is that a good or a bad thing? Hey there, NJRoot22.com here with another low carb keto carnivore chat. And today it's again about the sweet tooth and I'm really fascinated by the sensations that sweet foods cause in your mouth, both mentally and physically. Um, I guess we can break this down into two um, distinct uh, categories here. It's things that raise your blood sugar and those are carbs, sugar included, and then there's the actual sweet sensation in your mouth. Um, and that includes regular sugar, artificial sugar, bad sugar like aspartame, which really, I, from what I understand, screws you up pretty good. And then there's the new sugars, which are supposed to be great. Monk fruit, erythritol, xylitol, and similar um, sugars that uh, are claimed, claimed to not affect your blood sugar. But I've n mentioned this, that I, and I've noticed this, that when something happens when I, I'll make an ice cream out of heavy cream, and I'll throw some swerve in it, which is uh, erythritol, and I can't stop eating it. it. It creates this psychological sensation in your body that, that you just can't seem, it's never ending. So it makes me wonder that, it makes me wonder if you shouldn't eat anything sweet, even if it's a good sugar like erythritol, um, because sugar is so addictive and so on. And I talk to people Who's, who say, oh, I, I can't give up my cake or my candy or my chocolate. And they do that. They've convinced themselves that they can't do it. And they're basically victims of, of the food that they put in their mouth. They, they can't escape it. And you know, I've been self-reflecting and like I, I feel the same way. Like when I eat something sweet, even the good sugars, I find myself almost, um, I lack control or it, it's so good, quote unquote, you know, that's a quote good. We think it's good, but it's just some sort of pleasure center that gets pleased in our body. And I think it might be a good idea for everybody that's either dieting, whatever their diet is called, or if they're on a low carb keto carnivore diet, to not try and replace the sweets they used to enjoy with new sweets that, that keep you addicted to that sweet sensation. Um, we went a long time without eating any sweets, and when you eat something even as mild as a blueberry, which is extremely low glycemic, you, you find yourself, wow, that's sweet. And I, I don't know, I, I don't like the feeling that uh, I get when I eat sweets, so I think we're really going to stop even the good sweeteners. So what do you think about that? I think that's a good step for everybody to take. Um, you'll break the chains of addiction, uh, food addiction, and you'll get really, really in tune with your body and uh, take back control of your life and so on. Enjoy the rest of your day.